Here is a quick tutorial on how to use a guitar amp as a PA system. The thing that makes it all work and all magical is a gadget like this. You don't have to get this particular one. There are many out there on the market. Um, you can't plug a microphone directly into uh, a, uh, a line input or an instrument in input jack because it's the wrong impedance. It's the wrong level. So a gadget like this allows you to put low impedance or microphone level on one end and high impedance or line level or instrument level on the other end. Line level and instrument level are a little bit different, but uh, that's why you have volume knobs. Okay, here's how to make it work. Okay, we have the amplifier, we have the uh, impedance transformer, We'll just call it an adapter for now, for fun. A classic uh, dynamic microphone and a classic XLR cable. So you take this and you, you plug this transformer into that port. Then you plug the um, microphone cable in here. Sorry, I've got to use two hands. Put that one in. And then put the microphone where it belongs. Uh, need two hands. What am I doing this with one hand for? And that's it. So we're going to come around to the other side. I'm going to turn this on and we'll give it some volume and we'll take this and go. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. So this is a 15 watt amplifier that'll max out at about 30 watts, which is not very significant, but we've got a pretty big room in here and it's filling up the room and I'm only partly turning it up. Let me turn it up a little more. So we've got it at the 12 o'clock position and I'm backing up a little bit, a little more, a little more uh, volume out of it. And you heard a little bit of feedback, but this is a very bouncy room, a lot of hard uh, surface is bouncing the signal back. Not a big deal. Uh, when we use it for real, we'll plug in uh, a longer cord. There you go. Enjoy.